Hello, my satellite neighbors, and welcome to this next episode about sports feeds and satellite backhauls. So if you have a C-band or KU-band satellite dish, uh, you can get several uh, backhauls and feeds, satellite feeds, the live feeds from the satellite truck. So there's a truck that has all the TV cameras, they produce all the, the content, and they send it up on a satellite and send it to the TV station. So sometimes with these free satellite TVs, also known as free to air satellite TV receivers, you can pick up these feeds and they are not encrypted. So they're free, fair game for everyone to get and watch. So uh, in this video, I'd like to just uh, tell you some tips and strategies to get these feeds because it's kind of like a little bit of a hobbyist thing. It's the hunt to get these uh, feeds and to find them in the right place at the right time. So for to do this, you'll need a receiver that can do a blind scan, preferably. I use my Edison Me uh, OS Myo Plus 4K receiver to find these feeds and leave it scanning in the background till I find the feeds uh, or any receiver. Most receivers will that you can uh, get that at least do MPEG-4. That's another thing you do want to have these days. It's at least MPEG-4. And the industry is moving to MPEG Hevec H265. So you'll have to, um, if you haven't already upgraded did your receiver. So I'm going to show you some uh, of the web pages that will help you find the frequencies that you're looking for and also the satellites. So when you're searching for things, you can use forums like this forum here, TVRO set, or you can use Rick's Wild Feeds. And uh, when you're trying to set up your satellite dish, uh, I just want to go through a basic search here at TVRO set. This thing just wants to know that, confirm that I'm not a robot or... Uh, so here we are. And nice. the nice thing here is it shows the satellites that have new programming. This is not necessarily sports feeds, but it's just uh, any channels that might be there that have moved any of the satellite content. So I'm going to go to 91 West. So these are all the channels that are here on the satellite. The C-band channels, there's a lot here, but a lot of them are encrypted. But one channel, like with the Word Network, it's a religious channel, but it's always a very strong transponder. So when trying to tune the dish to get the satellite, I uh, sometimes aim at that one or BYU TV. BYU TVs kind of a, um, they t tend to be more family orientated and they have um, family orientated movies. Same thing with Light TV, which is uh, on the TCT Mux, which is another religious uh, broadcaster. And there's also the classic art showcased on C band. I'm going to scroll down here to the, the KU band side. So the KU band is a higher frequency than C band. So it's five digits and typically you don't need as large of a dish to receive this and you need a, K, a KU band LMB to receive the KU band signal. So C band and KU band have different types of LMBs and things like that. So here's a, a place, a hot spot in on the weekends for sports feeds. Uh, it has ABC news feeds, um, backhauls uh that you can scan in and there's a fox and there's a cbs channel that are full-time on the satellite now they, they there is the capacity to be a lot more channels on these satellites but they tend to use these satellites for feeds and they focus more of the network programming to subscription based stuff like dish network and direct tv uh, and i don't think there is any dish network stuff here i think bell uses uh yeah the nimic but it's not listed here. Subscription services, which will actually is a smaller dish, but then you do have to pay for the programming. But I'm a cheapskate. I don't want to pay for programming. I There's a lot out there now, and for what I watch TV, I just need a, a few 
channels to keep me happy. But anyway, that, that's not what this video is about. This video is about how to find sports feeds. This is where you can lock your dish on using these frequencies here. Uh, the symbol rate will be blah, 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 blah. Here it is here at the bottom. I like how it's laid out here on uh, TV Arrow set. So another place I highly recommend is Rick's Wild Feed. So this is a great site if you're into sports feeds. Uh, they'll, you know, motor motorsport feeds, uh, Rick's special announcements, NFL feeds, MLB feeds, NBA feeds, CFP feeds, you know, basically you name it, it's here. Golf, tennis, uh, fight feeds, um, which includes wrestling and other things like that. And network feeds too, which is uh, just if a new network pops up. So, for example, the Fox affiliate that's on 91 West, Ella Colorado, the usually they'll post that up there and they'll keep people up to date on whether it's still up. So, say for example, I go here to the fight feeds. I like fight feeds, and I like to also go into a little bit about wrestling because I mainly what I watch is professional wrestling type stuff. So you'll see this here. It'll say UFC stuff, which is usually live on Fox. Uh, Monday Night Raw, and then they should be one for SmackDown Live as well. And then also Mexican Wrestling, uh, all of the various uh, feeds. There is one for Ring of Honor. Uh, Ring of Honor has a feed. It's on Mondays and Tuesdays, usually around 11.30 on 87 West. So I'm just going to go to the last page here for, for example, WWE, because that's one a lot of people I know enjoy. They, they like that feed so it's just loading up here there we go so intel sat 34 55 west go to the bottom last report of that yeah so it's all the same thing pretty much uh it's uh posted here intel sat 34 55 west and there's the uh frequency this is also a c-band feed i don't know of any wwe stuff that's on uh uh, KU band. I guess you can watch WWE on that Fox feed on 91 West from, and then have to watch it delayed because it would probably Colorado would be on Mountain Time. I'm not sure. I I get uh, I get WWE uh, on Fox. I get that with my antenna. So for the most part, I just go to my antenna instead of having to bother moving my dish. I just keep it centered where I like to keep it and not move it over to 55 West. But for Mondays, I might move it over to watch Raw. Um, on this uh, on this uh, transponder right here, so yeah, this will, this will be uh, 3962. Might scan in as global cast uh, some nights and click it on SmackDown Live. Just sort of pretty much it's the same frequency on the same satellite, and it will show the test card. So when you're trying to tune your dish to watch a sporting event, you know it's this frequency. For example. You'll probably, for the first half hour before the program starts, you'll see the bars with in tone um, coming up. So, yeah, and that's another thing is when you scan for satellite feeds, you'll see the bar and tone stuff. It's like, why is it just bars and tones? Well, if you wait, it might later on have the programming that's just setting up the, uh, the, broad, uh, the television broadcast feed. Are you looking for a satellite dish, a satellite receiver, or a actuator, or a satellite meter, or an LMB, or any satellite products for your free-to-air setup? Go to tech2000.com. Look at their wide variety of merchandise of many free-to-air satellite products that will soothe your satellite needs. So thank you for watching. Please give this video a like, share, and subscribe, all that stuff. I have my discord group which you can come and chat with and i also have i uh, start set up a facebook uh, group north american satellite tv streaming you go there and you can ask to join i just ask for it to be north american related content there's lots of groups out there on facebook for uh the other parts of the world but i wanted to keep one mainly for the um, information about satellite in this region so please give this video a like. Uh, you can subscribe right here. You can 
uh, find watch one of these videos that YouTube has found in their algorithm found is best for you. And there's some playlists here at the bottom of the screen, which you can just watch all day long about satellite TV and absorb that information into your brain and be blessed by the satellite, free satellite TV information from all the videos that I've produced here on the Ottawa Octane channel.